a phenomenon that comes only once in a while. This Wednesday, it will be people on Easter Island, Argentinians and Chileans, who will be lucky to see the annular solar eclipse, also known as the Ring of Fire. During an annular eclipse, the moon obscures all but a ring-shaped sliver of the sun. The most important thing about an eclipse is the experience of it. And you can have that experience anytime there is an eclipse. You just have to kind of be, be an eclipse chaser. And it'll take you to wonderful places all over the earth. And you'll find a lot of native peoples who have different beliefs and different ways of observing things and celebrating things. And you'll have be doing things, take family with you, take something special to happen, because you'll be doing this at a time you can always calibrate. It's a way to chronicle your life to use the eclipses and the stories that will be spun and the photographs that will be made associated with each one. If you're in West Africa, Europe or Antarctica, there's a chance you'll experience an almost similar marvel in 2025, two partial solar eclipses that will result in crescent suns. You're going to need appropriate gear and not just any sunglasses or binoculars for the safety of your eyes.